Good morning, guys. It's Jan Kotsia returning with some exciting news. We have made a breakthrough because of one of the guys who've been watching the videos and uh, reached out via the comment features in the YouTube channel, DR. Thank you very much, mate. It's really much appreciated. DR has said, look at GBPUSD, see if there's a strategy that you can do there. And there is. And has got amazing results, even better than the DAX. However, it's very different, and you need to know that. So, DR, thank you, mate. This is exactly the kind of collaboration collaboration I was uh, hoping to receive and get. Guys, if anyone else has got ideas, please post them, and let's have a look. So, without further ado, here is the results of the strategy. A 70% win rate. Wow. That is exactly the kind of thing we are looking for, isn't it? Trading systems with 70% win rates. So how is this strategy performing versus the DAX? So first off, when you look at the dollars, it is less. However, it is really scalping. Um, I have traded it at five lots, similar to the DAX. Remember, the DAX was uh, five euros per contract. So I've taken uh, five contracts because we've got the index, or, or sorry, the, the exchange rate running at 1.22. So that if you take a $10,000 trade, which is your mini contract, that will give you exposure of 12200 the DAX is currently sitting at 15,000. Um, so to make it truly dollar for dollar comparable, you could trade it a little bit larger here, but for now stuck with the five lot per test run. Okay, so other than that, what are the parameters that you need to be aware of? We're looking at a take profit target of 25 pips. Uh, candle size of 30 pips, maximum candle size that is, uh, and that is why you see these periods here, here where we didn't trade, because the market was just volatile, and on every day of these, the candle sizes would have been bigger than 30 pips, so it wouldn't take the trade. Um, I did, you know, obviously test it for larger candles, and the results wasn't as promising so this is the best we can do but a 70 percent win rate great stuff uh 31 dollar per trade um result on average um profitable results so um a little bit under the dax but what i like i mean this is diversification now we have a strategy that we can run alongside the dax strategy and it will help smooth out your overall equity curve which is exactly the type of thing that we want to have as uh, conservative traders. Um, one more thing to just note quickly is, uh, see here, there's a few days where we trade more than four times. There's a six over there, eight over here. Um, now this is the result of the tight take profit. And what's happening is the trade would take profit but the rules will still be satisfied within the time frame, time frame, and you then have the opportunity to take the trade again. Now, is that a good thing? I don't know. Um, I'm a believer of the. I'm in the camp that believes that you give your trade maybe one second chance, and then you're done for the day. If it doesn't work out, then today's conditions is just not. Uh, going to be the conditions that supports your trading strategy because trading strategies don't work every day. Um, in this case, yeah, you would have had your losses, but eventually you actually ended the day positive. So a good thing over there. And then over here, where's those sixes now? I think one of them were good and one of them were bad. No saw that yeah first one yeah six you actually went down and then over here you went up so two out of three were positive so 
we'll just leave it at ease, as it is. The the code is. Um, I don't want to tamper too much with it. Anyway, uh, one more thing to do before we can sign off on this strategy. Um, Diaz mentioned that uh, the second trade for the day, i.e. when you take your trade in the first direction and then it wicks back the other way and you take your second trade, that that second trade should have um, the char characteristics of being a running trade. So you have a larger take profit and you see if you get to that or just let the trade close at the end of the day. That's a bit of a change of the code that I'll have to work on. Um, so right now, both trades will take 25 points, pips, and, and call it a day. So I'll be back with those results soon. Bear with me and uh, all the best. I hope you find this useful. And again, thank you, Trader Tom, for your strategy. And thank you, DR, for your additional observation. All the best, guys.